A meeting to promote diversity at Saline schools turns into a heated exchange. The discussion was in response to racist comments by high school students that surfaced last month on Snapchat. The comments were directed at three black students, Priya Mann, in Saline, and sat down with the parent at the center of today's controversy. Priya? The man identified himself as Tom Bertel and says he has six kids in the Saline School District. His comments provoke the ire of parents. But none more than when he interrupted a father talking about his kids' experience with racist students. He was crying because of the abuse that he was enduring in this school system. This morning was awful, and uh, we're very glad you are here. Adrian and Lori Iraola own Chalas and Celine. They say for years their kids were targeted because of their Mexican heritage. So they went to the district's diversity, equity, and inclusion meeting Monday to support other parents fighting for change. They didn't expect to have racist insults hurled at them. I am glad that uh, people are supporting us. I, I thank the gentleman for, for being vocal and expressing his opinion because it will make everybody realize that this is not a figment of our imagination. This is real and it's amongst us. They're hoping the Saline School District makes diversity training mandatory for teachers and holds students accountable. They say that the children are allowed to say these things because they're kids. It isn't working. It perpetuates the racism within the system. Now, after that racist Snapchat thread targeting black football players went viral, the district said these diversity meetings would be an important first step. It's not clear what, if anything, they plan to do following today's exchange. The board did not respond to multiple requests for comment. Reporting live, I'm Priya Mann, Local 4. Yeah.